we're at uh, Wally Bay and it's just this is the scene for uh, a lot of the outdoor shots of Pirates of the Caribbean. There's still some of the memorabilia about from the movie. We have these uh, what were supposed to be sacks of cotton, uh, these old crates, boxes. Uh, there's some of the cannons that were used over here in the uh, as backdrops in the movie. Just on that headland out there is the sea arch, uh, where you may remember that uh, they were hanging, supposed to be hanging the pirates and warning the pirates, saying, "Ye be warned." And of course, uh, the coffins. And just for good measure, I was actually one of the pirates in Pirates of the Caribbean. Uh, I was an extra, one of the extra pirates that worked on the movie. So I can tell you lots of stories. Unfortunately, in October last year, we had a, a hurricane, the surge from a hurricane, Hurricane Omar, and it wrecked, uh, the big surge waves coming in wrecked a lot of the original stage setting, uh, the dock setting. Um, so it, there's not a lot left of that, but there's still, it's still a good place to come and see and see where Pirates was filmed, or a lot of a lot of Pirates was filmed. Uh, we're now up at Fort Charlotte, which is the was the main fort base for the British, and this this base was uh, built in stages and it was completed in 1806. But it was used by the British prior to that. The uh, it's now part of its use now is as a Coast Guard station. And you can see the Coast Guard station up here. It's a lookout station for the Coast Guard. We then have Kingstown Harbour down here. A great view of Kingstown Harbour. And in, across the Beckway Channel, we can see Beckway. This was another venue for a lot of the filming for Pirates of the Caribbean. So what we have here are three examples of the different sized cannons that the British had here at the fort. And also here, very interestingly, is an old example of one of the wheeled units that they used uh, to, to move the cannons about. You can see here uh, where they held uh, the, the struts on both sides of the cannons. The uh, British were actually more afraid of attack from the Caribs and the French, their French supporters. And these three big cannons are actually pointing inland. Awaiting the attack. Uh, there were, in fact, three different Carib wars uh, that, that went on between the British and the Caribs and their French supporters. And, uh, Bob, if you move around here, you can actually see that there's not a piece of water in sight. It's the only uh, fort in the Caribbean that is laid out like this. Of all other forts in the Caribbean, their main gun emplacements are looking out to sea. So as I said, Fort Charlotte was the second setting for uh, a lot of the filming of Pirates of the Caribbean, the, the scenes that took place here in St. Vincent the Grenadines. The final uh, setting for uh, some of the filming was down the Grenadines in the Tobago Keys. Um, so the two main settings are at uh, Wallaboo and here. And uh, this is, as I said, is an original old fort, British old fort. Uh, completed in 1806, but started way before that. And it offers fabulous views of Kingstown Harbour, the Grenadines, and way beyond.